what's happening my people another day another video so i had these on deck around christmas time i was like on the fence about should i do a video for these or not i had them on feet today so i'm like might as well today was it was a bad day man today the saints lost in the playoffs and stuff uh, another heartbreak of three years in a row but man let's get into the shoes so from the description you see what these are nike box Shit. See a little bit of information and stuff. See that? So, had them on feet, so didn't have the bag attached. So, it comes with, come with the black laces, but then you got these white laces. You can put alternatively. <laughs> yeah, if that sound right. So, you go with the black laces. The white lace is cool. But I don't, I don't know, for me, for some reason, it feels like, it seems like it'll, it'll be too plain. Like, black isn't isn't necessarily, like, making them less plain. But it, I don't know, it just means, I don't know. It lightens them up too much. I'd rather the, the darker look, I guess. So, I didn't say what these are. You know what these are. So, Shattered Backboard ones. Got these around the Christmas time, man. So, check these out. And this is an older shoe. Came out a few years ago and stuff. But this is this is something that people always mention. Whenever people talk about quality with Jordans and stuff, people always talk about, man, but I want that shattered backboard leather. That shattered backboard leather. That shattered back. So it it has a, a standard of quality that Jordan showed at one time that we want to come back. So this isn't like an OG colorway or something. This isn't something that he wore in games and stuff. Uh, they had the the stuff overseas whenever he did break the backboard, but I don't think he had these on. But they are inspired by that feat that he, Jordan did shatter a backboard back in the days. But uh, got this this premium leather up here towards the toe and towards the middle, the middle and stuff, man. That leather, that leather is just real nice. Shit, I've already just today, shit, got a little bit of creasing from wearing them. But a lot of people say uh, jaw ones look better with the more wear that you have and stuff. So, uh. I ain't tripping off no creases or anything because I ain't trying to flip them or nothing. I got these. These are for wear. I had a pair back in the days and stuff, but I just uh, I got rid of them. Needed some paper. And something I always kind of kind of regretted. Like, I always missed them in the collection, man. So, got these back. Man, got that white. I did that black check. Just plain. Uh, bits of bits of orange was told with that leather. She was back. Got that the wings logo synonymous with the ones. The Nike Air on the tongue. So got this uh got this nylon type tongue. Come with these shoe trees and stuff. Got the Jordan shoe trees, just cardboard. One of the, in my opinion, I would say one of the top Jordan ones of all time. I put these probably like number three. What are, what are y'all thoughts? It's definitely top five. But I would say, I would say maybe like Chicago ones, bread ones, or band ones, whatever you want to say. And then the Shattered Bad Boys. That's, that's my opinion. Um, some people don't rock with ones. A lot of people, man, just going crazy about the ones. What do y'all like with ones, man? Do you, do you like the, the more recent ones, like the Fearless Packs and stuff? They have a few out of there. Now, I'm trying to slow up in 2020 with the shoes and stuff, man. Unless unless money starts pouring in, I want to try and be a little bit more responsible with my paper. But if money starts pouring in, I want everything. But uh, as far as like the Fearless, I want the Chicago to the UNC to Chicago's, and I want the Blue to Greats. So I would love to have those in the collections, man. If you got if you want to just send them over, man. I ain't got no uh. 
what's the what's the name of it? Everybody got the little site, man, where they try to make some money. You donate or whatever. I don't have one of those. But see, if you want my cash app or my PayPal, <laughs> or you want the address and just send them over, holler at your boy. So I'll do a review. But uh, definitely a, a cold shoe, man. And you can wear this. You can wear this with a lot of different things, man. You don't try to match up with this. You ain't, you ain't got to wear no orange. I had green on today and put this on, man, like like olive green. And see, I thought I was looking dope. But see, you can go all black with this. Just all kind of different colors, man. You can wear white, jeans, see, light wash, dark blue, black, gray, olive. All kind of jeans, she some white jeans, whatever. Shade. But I just want to show y'all this. Just, just have a video for today. Uh have some extra content for the channel. But you have seen these many times, multiple times and stuff. And one thing, one thing about the jaw ones, man, like you see this. Does this look like it catch the most grip in the world? Man, Jaw ones have a superb grip. Like the grip on here, I was I was shooting around the other day. I had my fly knit ones on. It was just shooting around. Man, the grip on here is pretty good for an old shoe. Like as far as that flat bottom, this this is not for basketball. Even though it was an original basketball shoe, but a flat bottom like that, nah. But uh. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna be a great of the most hated man. I let your boy, shit, try to bring bring you a little bit of content every day this week, man. Albums, I do my my music reviews and stuff, man. Albums is nobody dropping anything in 2020 yet, but hopefully that picks up. Oh, fragrance reviews, I got a few of those coming because it's been a while. But man, I let your boy, man. Peace out.